Odd World Stranger's Wrath. Somebody in Twitch chat told me this is an FPS game where your gun shoots skunks and bees like you shoot skunks at people. So at that point, I was pretty much legally required to check it out. I've never played Odd World in my life, by the way, so I got no idea what's going on here. I know there's like 35 different Odd World games, but this one has a gun in it. So it's the game for me. Give me your farts, bounty. Ah, uh, yes, that's the good stuff. Keep them coming. He can dab. There's a dedicated dab button. Double jump. Double jump. I thought it was a FPS game, but no game has ever been not improved by adding a double jump. If you can see the bottom, then falling will not kill stranger. No fall damage. This game's getting better all the time. Spider blast. Oh, it gets webbed up. Using the chipmunk, lure them away one at a time, then web them. Or I can just go punch them. I'm gonna punch them. I call this one freedom of player expression. Any game lets you say nah to the tutorial is a good game. So far, everything's coming up millhouse with this game. It seems like it's the best game ever. Am I playing the best game ever made? Is that a forklift? What? I thought we were in like animal fantasy land. They have forklifts in this game. Can you name a single bad game with a forklift? Didn't think so. Honestly, Red Dead Redemption has nothing on this game. Look at these immersive chicken citizens. They all talk at the same time and all their voices are pitched up like chipmunk voices. Making for a more immersive game experience. I have a feeling I'm, excuse me. Oh, did I just kill? Oh, I took his money. You can rob the citizens? This game is amazing. Give me your money. Cough up your cash, penguins. Ooh, finally, those outlaws are out of here. Yeah, but I think I messed my drawers. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Billy. Why did I laugh Damn. at that? You have acquired the thud slug. Fire at an enemy to knock them away and deal damage. Finally, I have normal bullets. Ready, aim, fire. Did it get him? No. Fire. Oh, yeah, there we go. Now that's what I call Halo CE Magnum. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> I'm downloading the app with the ripped guy doing push-ups and sticking with it for 30 days. Nice. Whenever you're on the Google App Store downloading a game, it always recommends an app where it's like, hey, get ripped in 30 days. And it's like, look, just because I'm downloading KOTOR for the iPhone does not mean I'm overweight and out of shape. I mean, I am and that app probably would help me. But I still find it a bit mean. It never recommended that app for me. Maybe you're in good shape then. I did have to give Google access to all my biometric data to download the new Pikmin game, which is not even that good. It probably was not worth Google having a total scan of my body. When you feed nectar to your Pikmin, flowers will bloom on their heads. It looks like your friendship level has increased. You're going into the fan. Come on. There we go. Oh my God. He got turned into beef chunks. You enjoying smacking my boys around, stranger? Yeah, I threw him in the fan. He's got a minigun. He's got a minigun. Alert, alert. I kind of want to push him into the fan. I get more money for bringing him in alive, but also there's a fan. Here he comes. Spider webs. There we go. Thank you, Charlotte. Oh, he just breaks out of it. Try again. Smack him. Spider. Thud. Oh, he's so close. He's so close. Knock him back. Knock him back. Yes. <laughs> Now that's how dukes go down. Hell yeah. I must celebrate his death in the customary way. Dab on him. You'll be happy to see that I've worked up an ingenious approach to your, um, little problem. <sighs> Due to the unique nature of this case, the operation is shaping up to be rather complicated. $20,000. You take a few grand? Looks like I need 20,000 sideways dollars to pay for my life-saving surgery from this weird insect man. I right, bounty store, what do you- ow. <laughs> I love how he smacks his head into the wall. The bees will be your favorite ammo. They're the most normal FPS-like. Nice, give me some bees. Look out, bad guys. I've got bees now. All the bees is like a machine gun, yes. Nobody told me this game had a bee machine gun. Odd world, more like greatest game ever made in the world. It's time for some uh, radical excavation. The British army be like, I say, jolly ho, old chap. It appears we've blown up Tutankhamun's tomb. Right, right. Take the tablets to our museum on the double. This town here ain't enough for none of y'all's none doggone area and large enough to not hold no walls of you. You ain't ain't not not from here. Sewer level, oh no. I'm confident this game can pull off the sewer level. It's been pretty good so far. Look at this, I can slide down the pipe. We jump. Oh no. Ah. In other bad games, this little ledge right here be something you have to climb while your character says funny dialogue, but not Odd World. Stranger's Wrath is a good game where Joe Mama is the objective. Dab him. Oh, we just combo him. We just combo him to death. Come on. Come on. He's so low. He's so low. Come on. 
A few more zaps, a few more zaps. Come on. Come on. Zap them. There we go. Dead or alive, you're coming with me because I shot you with a thousand bees. Is it a suicide bomber? What the? No. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop it. Don't. Don't do it. There we go. Whew. Don't let your kids play Odd World Stranger's Wrath. Jeez Louise. Let them play something a little less violent. Like Manhunt. Oh no, it's a gimmick battle. I gotta turn off all his pylons. Ah, oh, he's got a shield. Come on. They're so loud. They're so loud. Can we turn these down, please? I have the volume on too. What are you, a flamethrower guy? You're just gonna introduce the flamethrower guy in the middle of the boss fight? What is, no. No, 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 you can't do that. You can't do that. That's not allowed. He doesn't die. He doesn't get killed. What the, he can't, you can't. You can't just put the flamethrower guy in the middle of the boss battle. You can't do that. Don't let Packrat hide behind his shield. Thank you. How about you don't spawn a new enemy type halfway into the boss battle? That boss fight aged me five years. Now I qualify for Medicare. All right, that better give me $10 million. There should be a pain and suffering clause. That's the lowest bounty I've gotten so far. Come on. Whoa, look at the green land. This suddenly became a beautiful game. Suck up the boss. I'm sucking up your boss, fellas. He's mine now. Oh, they don't care. Oh, they're just gonna let me do my celebration. They're gonna let me do my celebration. Nice. Oh, and they go back to shooting. No! Oh, what? Come on. So you, uh, you heard what the five fingers said to the face? Uh, what? Nice punchline. Get it? I just got it because he punched. Ha 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 ha. You have achieved maximum comedy. Maximum armor, maximum power, maximum comedy. It's a Crisis 4, a stand-up comedy game. Not even maximum armor can shield you from emotional damage from hecklers. All right, do not run into any citizens. My goal is to dodge them all. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, took that corner pretty good. Don't hit the telephone pole. Nice, nice. Okay, it's a straight shot to the bounty store. Just got to mosey on in. Simple. I'm a guy. Hit the mailbox. I hear you paying out for a Steve head. You're telling me you have a Steve head? Maybe I knows where to find one for 20 grand. Oh, the doctor's dead. What? Damn, they strung up Doc. I didn't expect that. Okay, we got a bit of a battle here. Bit of a battle brewing. Am I supposed to die? Is it a scripted death? I hope not. Scripted video game deaths where you get kidnapped or against my religion. That's right. I'm a Mormon. Uh, I got captured. So, stranger, all we need to know is, where's the Steve? What the? <laughs> <laughs> the surgery was to remove his back legs. The surgery was to make him not have Steve legs. He was the Steve the whole time. That's hilarious. Good twist. I have to escape the explosive barrel factory. I thought oh, I love it here, but I'm going to get blown up. Oh, out the window. Ooh, environmental window kill. This game is winning my heart. Here, take this. It is armor worn only by your elders. It better look cool. It better be cool armor. Is it cool? Ah, looks like an MMO character. I like the plot twist. Not happy about not being a cowboy, though. This game is like if Shatter the Hedgehog was good. Got like a running platforming guy. He's got a gun. But the game's actually fun. Didn't think that was possible. Secto makes a dollar. I make a dime. That's why I kill people in the bathroom on company time. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. These controls are not too great. They're gonna make me scream. Ah, waterfall.mp3, my favorite sound effect. Let's move out of range of that as fast as possible, shall we? Get onto the boat. Get onto the boat. Here we go, here I go, getting onto the boat. I'm gonna climb on onto it. Okay, I'll push it next to the dock. There we go. And then I'll climb onto the dock. Then I'll climb onto the boat. Just as planned. Oh, the D-Day mission. Here it is. Every game must have it. <gasps> it's the bad guy of the game. Is it? Maybe it's not. It's just like a weird Cthulhu man. Whoa, he can web me up. He's got webs too. Wiggle the movement controls. Or press the button. Ah. Stop. I'd like to be able to fight him. Oh my god. Kill him, bees, please, please. Okay, the bees killed him. He's not that hard. Time for the Halo Warthog run. An interesting inclusion in the Cowboy Cow game. The only thing is, if you're gonna make the Halo Warthog run, you have to put in the Halo music. You gotta license it from Bungie. 
You can't have like generic dun da dun dun. That sucks. Also, don't make it impossible to beat is good. Door. Oh, who? no, let me in. Come on. That was enough space. That was enough space. What was that? I got ripped off. We're in a Bioshock Rapture hallway. That means the final boss is coming soon. Oh, the bad guy is going to retreat into a stupid chamber. I got to fight two of these octopus guys. Okay, well, the octopus guys suck. More ammo. Whoa, whoa, they got a spin move. I didn't know they had spinning. That's a good trick. That's a good trick. Stop it. Stop it. Let me stand up. Let me stand up. If I could stand up, I could play the game. Let me let me stand back up. All right. Good move. Good attack. Oh, my God. Let me let me stand. This is casual difficulty. This is the easy difficulty. Let me stand up. Let me let me stand. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> wow, what a battle! No, this can't be. I got crushed. Okay, I can't believe that octopus wasn't my father. I thought they were setting up that twist the whole game. <gasps> he was a thief the whole time. The octopus was my father. I was just joking. There's no way he was a Steve in an octopus costume. What? <laughs> what? He was a Steve in an octopus costume. It's free. 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 What? Why was he the bad guy? Why did he want to be evil? Oh, there's the real octopus. The real octopus didn't die. Oh, the octopus latched on to the old Steve guy's head and controlled him to be evil, but when I shot him with a gun 55 times, the octopus came off of his head. I give this game a 7.5 out of 10. It would be like 8.5 to 9-ish, but that last part with the damn... Once you lose the cowboy stuff, it kind of becomes not as good. They should have just kept the cowboy part the whole time. It was a good twist, though. It was a twist I didn't see coming with the octopus guy. So check this game out. It's pretty good. But if you want to quit halfway through, I'm not going to judge you. Hey, I got an idea. Why don't we get ourselves a fine meal of pork and beans? Oh, come on, Villaho. We just had that for breakfast and lunch.